Hi guys, good evening. Sumit Banot here. Guys, today we are going to talk about something really very interesting regarding our smartphone batteries. And I hope that you will really like the video. So guys, uh, we all know that our smartphones, they have come of quite an age because all the different things in our smartphones, maybe the display of the smartphone, the processor of the smartphone, the RAM of the smartphone. In each of these things, we have seen a rapid development. But one thing which is still lacking in our smartphones, that is the battery. You might be remembering that even of the times when we used those Nokia handsets, that keypad based Nokia handsets, in that we used lithium ion batteries and still we are using those lithium ion batteries in our smartphones. No doubt, these lithium ion batteries which we are using nowadays, they are having that fast charging technology uh, which is used by a number of companies these days like oneplus samsung almost all the companies guys they are using uh, these fast charging technologies but still we are far far behind in battery development technology for our smartphones so keeping this in mind samsung which is one of the major smartphone manufacturers in the world they are going to introduce graphene based batteries in the smartphones now this is a new word uh, for you might be a new word for you graphene now what actually this graphene material is of which they are making the cell phone batteries well guys to make it simple for you uh, let me tell you that graphene it is one of the uh, you can say a very very special kind of uh, single layer material which has carbon atoms arranged in such a manner on a single layer that it provides nearly 100 times better conductivity that is it has 100 times better uh, flow of electrons as compared to copper which we use or in all our semiconductor devices and it has nearly 140 times more faster transfer rate as compared to silicon now what this silicon is uh, for simplicity you can simply understand that in all our electronic devices all these we use one of the major semiconductor materials which is known as silicon so what Samsung has done is that they have used this graphene ball technology in the batteries which are going to come in Samsung smartphones maybe in by the end of 2020 or at uh, at the most by the starting of 2021 Samsung has uh, promised that they are going to introduce a smartphone which is based on this graphene cell technology now the major major advantage guys of this graphene cell technology which they are going to use in their smartphones is that due, uh, due to the structure of this graphene material they would be able to reduce the size of the battery that is you can put a more capacity battery in your smartphone and due to which you would have a bigger capacity battery in your smartphone and which would last longer and which would charge rapidly so rapidly that guys they are claiming that it would fully charge your smartphone in under 30 minutes and under extreme circumstances it can charge your smartphone even in 12 minutes you heard that right guys if your smartphone is going to charge in between say something between 12 to 30 minutes that's a astonishing astonishing development in this aspect because you can imagine that in the morning when you get up you go to the washroom you are just wash your face and uh, do you brush your teeth and right your smartphone is charged really really amazing and another thing about this uh, graphene is that it would definitely replace these lithium ion batteries which we are being used in our smartphones because you all know that these lithium ion batteries no doubt they are uh, uh, having this fast charging technology but still these batteries are bulky they occupy more space in the smartphones and obviously they are much less efficient as compared to the graphene batteries which are going to come in the smartphones in the coming you can say months and year 
So guys, uh, this is what I wanted to tell you about this graphene cell technology which Samsung is going to introduce in its smartphones. Once again, to repeat, the advantages of this graphene cell technology would be that the size of the battery would be reduced in your smartphone. You would have slim smartphones. You will have smartphones with uh, higher battery capacity which would charge rapidly and you will have a wonderful, wonderful smartphone experience. So guys, uh, this is what uh, you are going to see in the future smartphones from Samsung and I expect that later on uh, many manufacturers would be switching on to this graphene cell based technology and be putting these graphene batteries in our smartphones. So guys, thanks for watching the video. If you have any queries about this graphene uh, batteries which are coming in the smartphones, don't hesitate to put a question in the comments box below. Thanks for taking your time out and have a wonderful day. And as always, I will see you in the next one.